Hello and welcome back to Quill Pig Gaming Blind Playthrough of Kingdom Come Deliverance. Um, so in our last session we tried to get uh, inside a monastery and got sent to jail instead. Uh, so we went bandit hunting and then we got sent to uh, Sir Robert here in Talenburg. We went human hunting for him and we accepted the horse race quest which starts today. Oh, these seem to be the other racers. Hmm. Wait, nope. We need the other horse. We need the gray. Where's the gray? Right here. Mount up. And we need to make sure that we don't lose. Or at least we don't have a bad outcome from this. This all started with us trying to improve our reputation over in a horse farm. But he also dressed lightly. No weapons. Hmm. What time does our quest start up? Sport of Kings? I think that's the one we're on now. Let's, uh, let's remove that one. Yeah. At noon. <laughs> Quest started, Tomberg horse race. raining. Rainy day for a horse race. Hmm. Let's do it. It's not quite noon yet. But I don't want to miss the race. Uh, the instructions that we got in our last session were that we're going to be given an order to go to of certain stakes or flags or something. We're supposed to go to those in order and then get all of the flags or something and then bring them back. And the first person back wins. And this is not as fast a horse as our war horse. It's almost noon. Oh, here's Sir Divish. Do we talk to you? Okay, well, we don't talk to you. Maybe you just say go. Oh, come on. Don't waste our haircut. There we go. I welcome you all to the great Talmberg horse race, where the best teams and riders in the land will compete to see who talks it. Fate and fortune won't decide the winner here today. Horsemanship, knowing the lay of the land, and quick wit will bring victory. But I won't hold things up any longer. Compare 
Tree and Uzits. Well, it looks like our horse is faster. We need to get him off. How do we get in front of you? That doesn't work. Our horse is faster. Dead tree and oozits. Dead tree. Where's the dead tree? Where's the dead tree? Come on now. Dead tree and lose it. Don't see it anywhere. Hmm. Oh. How do we get turned around? Yeah. Okay. Okay, we got that. That's not a dead tree. It's by the yeah. by the church. Otherwise, Newhoff won't be able to sell their studs to Tallenberg, and they need the income. Even the Stable Master wants us to win. The Tallenberg Stable Master. Oh, get out of the way. Oh, come on. We're gonna have to reload. Oh, come on! Why are you slowing down? You got the stamina. Oh, come on. You just. You just stop. Could, could do it. Catching up.
we were. Is there something else we could have done to prepare for this? Oh, where did everybody go? Up here? By the windmill? Quarry near Tomberg. Quarry near Tomberg. Is that the quarry? I think that's the quarry. So lost. We have really good horsemanship. I don't know how else we could have prepared for this other than by knowing where we're supposed to go. Which supposedly they don't know either. Have to cross the river, which is why they're all following the road. And our horse is definitely faster. Okay, where's the pole at? Okay, where's the next? Okay, go back to the start. The messages are too slow. Oh, come on. Get running. You've got the stamina. think you're gonna win it. Nope. 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 Oh, you... Should we have pulled out a bow? Well, we came in second. I don't think we won it. Welcome back. You might not have won, but you didn't fare so poorly. That okay, good. So you're boy from Zora? Mm, that horse did make an impression on me. Your horsemanship could use some work. Uh, maybe That's the enough. task could use a little bit of improvement. I believe I'll purchase half my horses from Neuhof and half from Bufus. You, you know what? Aura, That's a good ending. Thank you, my lord. Thank you. I'll pass your message on to her. Bring Zora's horse back. I, uh, I don't care much for this horse. I like my horse. All right. You know what we can do, though? Nah, we, can, we need to actually write it back. Let's see. Back to Newhoff. Uh, let's go up through the Huntmaster's Cabin area. And 
ride down basically the way we came to Tomberg from Newhoff when we were chasing after uh, Ginger. This will take us there, right? I think so. Yeah. Just gotta watch out for bandits. And you don't track on this road. Yeah. Tree in the middle of the path. Steep. All right. That's past a bandit camp, but we can do that. We took out that bandit camp just a couple days ago. Had a good fist fight in a while. Ooh. Yep, human. All right, you're down. I'm willing to take on a fist fight. There we go. But not a fist fight against two. Oh, come on. arrows to the face? That was a, a greeting. 
certain lands. guys all right we're bleeding a bit but we did just take out like five or six guys all right Put that away. Let's bandage ourselves. Okay, that's it there. Food. Come on, I want that arrow back. Leader's mask. Mm. Captain's helmet. That's worth money. your toes through your boots. Bandage. That's replaced. We did not have breakfast. arrow broken arrow piercing arrow mm. okay nothing else there Also a human, right?
guys in there? Ooh, did we just kill a good guy? We might have just killed a good guy. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's stealing. Oops. But why were you... Hmm. Okay, I'm not sure what just happened there. I did want to go back to the human leader because we put lots of arrows in him. And I don't think we got them all back. Don't have anything else though. If we did get them all back. I'm a little confused. Okay, horse is fine there for now. Bandits. That's replaced. So was this bandits fighting humans? And who is that a guard for? Because this appears to be a human camp. Okay, that dog's got to go. You can't be allowed to run away. Got a second dog. shoot the dog to begin with. Shield, Common Saber.
All right. Cheese, sure. I don't think those are actually worth all that much. Lockpick. Our arrows. You know what? Let's, uh, nourishment. Eat those apples. 16. Yeah, let's eat the bread. And a carrot. Got lots of human ears. I don't know what this guard was doing here in the middle of nowhere. Just right next to the camp. Nobody else in here. This is one we couldn't open. Right? Oh no, we did open it. That was not a difficult chest. Alright. Now, did we search everybody? Yeah, I think we're good. Well, it's like 10 guys so far this morning. Or afternoon, I suppose. Um, now we need to head to, yeah, southeast. Let's take the east road. I'll let this turn around and And back the way we need to go. This one, southeast. That's another camp. This is the one that we went to. We couldn't open the chest in. Is straight ahead. Uh, Good man. Hmm. Well, we've already done a bit. Faint-hearted knight. Oh, okay. You again? Ah, yes. I suppose you want to challenge me to a duel? Yes. Well, it was just my intention. I've been practicing. I got much better at it. Wait a while. There's something I'd like to tell you first. I'm all ears. Duel for what? You can't duel with someone. 
happen just like that. There has to be a reason. Could I have thought knights fight for their honor? Our armor is expensive to repair. Only I'm not a knight. We ought to fight for something more substantial. Like what? Uh, we probably have a better sword than him. No doubt you carry some coin on your travels, don't you? I... I do. So you can bet that then. Let's do it. Wait, well what about me? What do I get if I win? I'm giving you a chance to fight for honor. That's a valuable <laughs> thing, isn't it? Let's get to it. Uh, wonderful. You done? Hey, Papa. Good thing I had saved my travels. At least things will be more adventurous now. All right. I don't know if that was worth it. Well, if he only had 20 groschen on him, then he yeah. definitely didn't have a good enough sword for us to take. There's supposed to be tons of people around for uh, weird little adventure stuff and pilgrims and beggars. We haven't met any anybody that just asked us for money. We're just standing here though. How are you with riddles, hmm? Riddler? About a small wager, my good man. That depends. A wager over what? It's simple. I tell you a riddle. If you solve it, you get back twice the sum you wager. If you don't, I get to keep your coin. Uh, five? Sure. Well, who are you? Who might you be, anyway? Me? No one important. But you can be sure of one thing, lad. I walk the world. Collecting riddles, stories, and sometimes arms. I live from day to day. But enough of my babbling. Do you want to engage your mind? That sounds good. Let's do it. Now, listen carefully. In the feast hall on the table are ten candles. Suddenly, a gust of wind throws open the window and blows out okay. ten candles. A little later, Another candle goes out. The servant, therefore, closes the hall window. Now the wind cannot blow out any more. So how many candles can the servant find to relight the following morning in the hall? Well, three. Because the other seven would have burned out. Three. Is the correct answer. While the wind blows out three, seven burn down completely overnight, so the next day, only those three can be rekindled. Oh, what can I do? Here's your ten groschen. Spend them as best you can. Maybe we'll meet up again sometime. We may well do so. Huh. Thank you. Well, that's interesting. Okay, now there's another horse on the road. We're meeting all kinds of people today. Whose horse are you?
Who belongs to you, horse? I don't understand. Hmm. Maybe it belongs to that faint-hearted knight. Yeah. Turn this horse in. Good evening. About the race. That race. It was quite something. So the race is over. Tell me, please, how did it go? It was very close. Lord God in heaven, don't keep me in suspense. <laughs> Sir Dibish decided that he'll buy half his horses from you and half from Uzra. Oh, those are wonderful tidings. I was afraid I'd have to shut things down here. Thank you, lad. Oh, one more thing. If you ever need to buy a horse, come and see us. I'll give you a nice... Well, we already have a good horse, but that's fine. Oh, good money. All right, so... Quest completed, support of kings. How is our reputation now? 44. Well, I guess that's better. Good luck, then. Okay. Can't talk to Ginger kind of late. I guess we can head back to uh, Rote. We're pretty close. Yeah. Got our own horse back. bandits okay so now it seems like um, we can turn in bandit ears in Rate and cumin ears in Talmberg so that should be a way to continually make money nothing to yeah. say Sunset coming up here. And I'd previously found a uh, abandoned house in town. One that we're able to stay at without any trouble. Right here. Under the dove coat. Dove coat. Yeah. We close this and we can use this like our own house, kinda. How's our food? Ah, fine. 
Uh, we can't use the chests. Those still aren't ours. But we can use the bed. So we got plenty of stuff. No banded ears to turn in. Lots of weapons to sell, though. If we want to sell them. Hmm. You know what? Get out of here. Let's head back to the mill. It's still light enough to get through town without needing a torch. I wish there was a special button just for torch, so you didn't have to move it back and forth to your inventory. Or that it automatically popped on at the right time. I guess that's less immersive than having to think about how things work in this world. It makes sense the way they did it. Sir Hans? We do want to get more stuff from our chest and take it to go sell. up first. Alright, what do we want to take out of here? Take that, take that, take that, that. I'd like to keep one of each of these, one, um, or not that, one Warhammer type or Mace type and a Axe type so that we can go practice those. 115, 115, 115, they all weigh eight pounds. So let's take that one and that one out. We're keeping the helmets. Take those. Those are only a pound a piece. We got a lucky die and an odd die. Alright, what stuff do we have on us? Move that to the horse. That's not better. That's not better. One thirty three. We seven pounds. Also weighs seven pounds. How's that look? Ooh, that one looks kind of cool. Two of those. We only have 20 piercing arrows left. That we want to put back in the chest. else we wanted to move around. Let's uh let's move some marigold potions. Four 
We'll sell some better hunting arrows. Okay, so 133, weight 6, or 133, weight 7. But this one is kind of cool. So let's, uh, let's unequip that. Let's equip that. Yeah, that one looks cooler. Charisma 17, Charisma 18, Charisma 17. All right, now stuff to put away. Move that, move that. How many of those, oh yeah, how many of those do we have? We only need one. There we go, we can sell those. All right, sleep and save. Then we'll go back into Rite. We'll go sell some stuff. Oh, we had food on us. We should check to see if it's rotten or if we can still sell it. And we should make sure we don't have anything stolen on us. Nothing stolen. Okay. Nothing stolen on the horse. Our horse is a thief. All right, good. Our haircut's wearing off. Barely has any juice left. Yeah. Okay, so I think maybe we could have won that horse race if we'd known where to go from the beginning. But I don't know how we get that horse to ride any better. Unless we invested several thousand groschen into um, like horseshoes and stuff like that. Alright, let's take the stuff off the horse. There's no reason to repair these now, because we're just selling them. You don't buy anything else. Don't be with you. What can I do for you? Let's talk trade. Alright. Mace. Saber. Axes. Sell two of these daggers. All right. Now, you don't have anything left to buy, do you? Warhammer. Saving Grace. We looked at that. That's lower than what we have. In fact, we seem to have better stuff than you have. Herod Sword? What is that? Slash damage. Oh, it's the reverse of our damage. Heavy Battle Axe. Let's 
Bailiff's Mace. Oof. Okay. Check basket. We'll just take that. Hmm. Let's move, move, move. Yeah, let's move that torch over. The Brigadine. Do some repairs. Alright, armor's kit. Yep, that's gone. Blacksmith kit. Can't do that. Tailor's kit. We get the tailor to do the rest of the work. Those are expensive. Nope. All right. We still have a torch to sell off. God save. What can I do for you? Talk trade. Sell those. And that. That's all you'll go for. Do you have anything worth buying? Mm, no, ours is better than that. I think our stuff is better than everything you have, or it's the same. I think we're now at the top end of the shop. Yeah. I think so. About repairs. Nope. No reason to repair those. Taylor. Not in yet. They wake up late. Alchemist not in yet. Hmm. Sell off some food. And some arrows. Don't want to sell off anything there. Don't want to sell spurs here. Let's sell off some hunting arrows. Let's move uh, 200 over. Well, 230 is fine. Go 
people buy food, right? Good day to you. What do you need? God be with you. Bacon, cheese, drinking water, pretzel. Yeah, that's good. Alright, let's go sell some bows and arrows. Lots of little updates like this. But we now have quite a bit of money. Every time I walk over to him, he moves. I I can be of some humble... uh, talk trade. Sell. Sell one of those. All of these. What's that worth? Yeah, decent money. Some bows. sell these off too. Alright. Uh, 400? Okay. Sure. Alright, so that's good there. Still waiting on Taylor. Ah, there we go. You're open now. Let's talk repairs. I'm honored that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. With that done, everything's looking good. Good part of the day. The quest giver here. Should we talk to the quest giver? No, that's the same guy who wants us to go. Um, rob some merchant of a stamp because they was rude to him. Yeah. I I bet there's a ton of like dark quest line stuff. You can just become a burglar. There's also a quest here. What's your quest? Mm, Miller's kind of not a great guy either. Bet on the tourney. That's what it is. Do you have work for me? Training. Hmm. What about Teresa? A quest line for her. Well, you're a sight for sore eyes. Oh, okay, we've been away for a while. Um. Wait a second. Do we have anything for her? Bouquet for Clara. We can give her the bouquet. Wait a second. Do we have anything better? Looks like they're expecting us to bring her something. I don't think she'd want a shield or a shirt. 
from another woman. Hmm. What would she like? Give her a ring. That might have tones. Give seven of these over. You could try the bouquet. I'll just ask if we take a walk. So we take a walk. You don't give up, do you? Well, let me think. Hey, Where back. would you care to go? Don't you want a little wager on the rat egg morning? Uh tavern, Gallows Hill, stroll along the river. What if we took a stroll along the river? Why not? That sounds lovely. Shall we go? Let's, Let's go. go. Let's, um, let's remove some of this stuff. Going for a walk. We're a little overdressed. Let's put those back on. So we're wearing something. That's fine. Wait, where'd she go? That's a nice little walk together. That was a good idea to go for a walk. Not that I don't like the milk, but you get tired of it. So I'm glad you took me out. I'd love to see the markets in the forest one day. Have you ever been to Prague? No, I nope. haven't. I have been in Kuttenberg, I'd like to go to Prague. Prague must be much bigger. <laughs> I've heard it's pretty smelly though. Yeah, so many people in one place. So many hours old. Oh, <laughs> it's disgusting. I'd love to listen to that young preacher, Jan Hoops. They say he preaches in the common tongue. Everyone's talking about him. I bet he's just handsome. That's why the women dote on him. <laughs> You're a right one. Preacher doesn't need good looks for people to listen to him. And what about that fine fellow at St. James? St. James? Full well why all the girls have started going to confession. Oh, yeah. And you have too. So don't give me any of that. You scoundrel. Well, all right. I admit I find him handsome. But that doesn't make me a bad Christian. I'd never dare to suggest such a thing. No, if you didn't walk right in the middle of the path. Oh, what? Let's not dawdle. Oh, we can totally outrun you. Should we let her win? Nah. Oh. How far are we going? Still going further? Oh, how far are we going? You going to the pole? <laughs> that was fun. Sit down here next to me, Hal. Sit with Teresa. This is nice. And what about you? 
I heard you're helping Sir Radzig. Sir Radzig has me running in a few errands. I have to say, he always treats me well, and I make a wage. So you've had your turn of luck. What's it like serving nobility? <laughs> uh, it's work like any other. I don't know. I suppose it's a job like any other. Of course. I'm sure it's no different than being a charcoal burner. You'll have to try harder than that. Oh, his hair's braided right at the corner. That's cool. It's a nice detail. Now then. Ah, oh, Henry, what am I going to do with you? Wandering the land, turning innocent girls' heads. Um, not really. Hands full of duties. <laughs> Turning girls' heads. Not likely. I have my hands full with my duties. Sir Radzik hardly gives me time to take a breath. Really? A common smith's son and our liege lord can't manage without him. That's good. It shows you're talented. But now I have to go. Can I go with you? Just a little way. I don't want anyone to gossip. Okay, ask Teresa out again in a couple of days. All right, well, we'll do that. Thank you for coming with me. Please come and see me again. Okay, she liked going for a walk. That's nice. We do owe Teresa quite a bit. She saved our lives. All right, um, hmm. Well then, what should we have for next? We still have to go take out some bandits. You know what? I think... Hmm. Between this session and the next, we'll get to Tamburg. And we'll start off next section in Tallenburg. And we'll go after the camp leader. Take this camp out. Turn those in along with the other uh, Q and ears that we've picked up. Uh, and then I think we'll go on to this, get this main quest piece started. Sounds like a pretty good deal. Um, I'll also see if in between sessions I can improve lock picking enough to be able to go after some of those more stubborn locks. Let's see, what are we at? Probably need to get that up to level 10 and then use that special brew we have. Hmm. I think we've run into somebody that could help us with lockpicking, though, if I can remember where. Yeah, pickpocketing went up when we pickpocketed that guard that we thought was a human. Anyway, uh, I hope you're enjoying this playthrough as much as I am. If you are, please like, share, subscribe, and comment, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.